Alright, what's going on everybody? Uh, I know you guys haven't seen me or Noah in a little while, but we've just been so busy with school and uh, work. We were working so hard and I shouldn't say so hard. We were just working a ton during the uh, during the summer so we can fish in the winter and put up more content for you guys in the in the uh, in the winter when the uh, big fish start to run. But I'm, I'm going to be heading out today going for a little bit of some creek action. Noah's got a real good video coming out. He went out for some kings and uh he connected with a pretty big one um off of lake ontario so yeah we appreciate you guys uh sticking with us um we're gonna be putting a lot more content as you guys know throughout the winter that's how we usually operate and i know you guys like to watch the uh the river and the, the trout videos a lot more than just the uh smaller bass and stuff so that's what we're gonna be uh uploading pretty soon as soon as they start running we're just waiting on them um but we're gonna get out there today and hopefully catch maybe some bass or who knows whatever can bite um but yeah so thanks for watching and uh hope you guys enjoy as always all right guys got my first fish hooked up here i'm using a three weight fly so makes it fun too is the, even the little ones i mean look at how this guy's dogging me i shouldn't say dogging me but chunky little smallie first one of the day not probably about i don't know six inches small he uh hammered that fly though um yeah first fish now the new season starting I'll let him go but yeah i uh me and noah obviously we're gonna be pumping out a lot more videos now um we just you know how it goes with school and everything we just get so busy that it kind of gets difficult so we'll be uh we'll be good to go here in the next coming weeks as soon as those the kings are staging out at the river so hopefully they start coming in soon but i mean it'll probably be at least a month until we really see decent steelhead action in the creek so right now it's just the uh summer bite it's the end of summer kind of the uh slowest part of the season up here but but yeah it's, it's good to get back out Noah was working almost every day I was working almost every day during the summer so it's it's nice but this is what we like to do and this is our favorite favorite thing to do is fish so it's nice to get back outdoors but stay tuned hopefully we can get a bigger one here I mean I just kind of came out today for some fun but We'll see we'll see here i did see some bigger ones so i think we'll we'll eventually hook up here but stay tuned all right guys got another something small on but i am decent i think it's a little bit better of a smallie oh yeah a little probably 12 inch here be a little smaller. Smack the fly though. There he is. Come on. Nice. Eh, maybe only a couple inches bigger than that other one. Still not the uh, big guy we're looking for, but right in that little white streamer pretty fish though nice right, guys I think we got our best one of the day on right now we'll see though hit it pretty hard I'll tell you guys though if, if you guys are Looking to get into fly fishing or don't know how to get into it. I think three weight fishing for bass is some of the most fun ultralight fishing that I've ever done. And uh But I mean, my recommendation 
be go get a three weight or a ultralight fly and just go out to your whatever body of water you got around you i mean the fish will basically eat everything in the summer any fly you throw at them and this is going to be the biggest of the day so that's cool let's get him in look at that beautiful fish and I mean, you probably thought it was going to be a lot bigger based on that fight, but even these little guys pull quite a bit in the little three weight, so a lot of fun. A lot of fun. All right, guys, decided to switch up the fly a little bit. Put a little weight on it, too, and it paid off first cast. And this might be the biggest one of the day if we can get them in. Can't tell if there's another one chasing them or not, but fighting good. Feels good. Feels good to finally get out and fish. I honestly haven't fished in I don't even know. Probably a month. Yeah, this is going to be the biggest of the day for sure. Nice. Not huge by any means, or not even big. But I saw Trumper Lucky's missing half of his uh, dorsal, which is pretty interesting, but pretty fish. Nonetheless. All right, guys, it's going to be it for me today. It was an all right day, you know, caught a couple little ones. It's pretty hot still. It's September and it's like 85 degrees. It's getting kind of annoying, but hopefully the weather will change here pretty quickly. But, you know, Noah will have that uh, King video for you guys coming out soon. I just want to make this one just so let you guys know what's happening. I know it's been a while and we apologize for that, but we'll get the videos coming out here pretty pretty quick for you guys as soon as the fish are here so we uh appreciate everything you guys do for us watching our videos and uh we'll catch you guys on the next episode of the outsiders